We're back in Houston's biosphere at Stratosphere 2023. This year, come join me and 1,001 other attendees at the new Marriott location. And before I lose my head, cred, I'm Kite, the fox behind the camera. First stop, main events for the pre-parade photo. We'll wish a lucky dragon a happy birthday, and maybe also get some good luck back from a Maneki Neko. And if you ever see me and my camera, don't be shy, I don't bite. This one doesn't look as willing to share their noms with us. You know, I just realized this guy is probably behind the crazy green tint in this room. And if these suits don't get rid of your fear of bugs, I'm sure nothing will. Pride in the Biosphere was this year's theme, and it's wonderful to see everybody celebrating their truest self. In the meantime, why not check out the parade on my channel as well? We're gonna make it back to the lobby, and then we're gonna check out the rest of the con. But not before we stop by and check out some funny fursuits bapping each other. Khan has grown quite a bit from last year, now sporting a dedicated dealer's den and artist's alley hallway, as well as giving the con a bit more room for us to maneuver around in. After we get some gaming done, let's check out the guests of honor as well as the con charity. This year, $3,195 are raised for charity. Before we go back to the lobby, let's check out some awesome Artist Alley artists. Those plushy meats are probably the best I've ever seen and they're just mouth-watering. Can you guess what I got from this booth? I got myself a new hat and my friends couldn't help but actually come back here like four times. 
Looking for soaps and scents to keep you from getting smelly? Look no further. I don't think they're for sale, but they're so cute I want to take them home. Honestly, box heads are some of my favorites. video, before we move on to the traditional fursuit showcase, I wanted to take a moment to show off the main events at Stratosphere. The dance competition was a wonderful show of skill, and each set made me want to see more, especially one surprising fakeout. Suit runway and costume competitions showed off attendees' creativity and style, and even had some great prizes for those who placed. And the fursuit games were a ton of fun to watch, and I bet even more fun to take part in. I have to admit, I really loved the food sub theme. It was so unique compared to a lot of the other games I've seen this year. Make sure to check out the next video as I go over my favorite suits from Stratosphere 2023. I want to start working on these sort of mini con reviews to give you an idea of what the convention is like. Maybe next time I'll go into some tasty foods because I, I kind of forgot to record everything I ate. But yeah, um, the, the crepes at La Madeline are really good. Uh, but yeah, I'll just leave you with that. Go get some food and check out the next video.